Good morning, everyone. Thank you for joining me this morning for the Outstanding Athletic Performance Initiative presentation. I'm delighted to be here with the Premier, the Honorable E. David Burke, for this special event. The public should be aware that Bermuda, Bermuda's elite athletes who achieve the required standards to compete and secure a medal in prestigious events like the World Championships, the Olympic Games, the Pan American Games, the Commonwealth Games, and the Central American and Caribbean Games, CAC, are entitled to receive funding rewards from the government of Bermuda. As part of our commitment, the Ministry of Youth, Culture, and Sport has established the Outstanding Athletic Performance Incentive Program to highlight the significant value that this government places on those who perform at such a high caliber. This initiative not only recognizes the excellence of these outstanding athletes, but also represents the gratitude of the government for the way that they represent Bermuda with pride and distinction. From June 23rd to July 9th, 2023, Team Bermuda participated in the Central American and Caribbean Games, the CAC Games, in San Salvador and the Dominican Republic. During these games, our athletes performed exceptionally well on the world stage. And today, we have a wonderful opportunity to recognize and celebrate those who excelled in their respective sports and disciplines. Team Bermuda brought home six medals in the CAC Games. Emma Harvey, in swimming, won two medals, a silver in the women's 50 meters backstroke and a bronze in the 50 meters butterfly. Madeline Moore, also in swimming, won a silver in the 50 meter freestyle. Dej Miners in athletics won a bronze in the 1500 meters. Caitlin Conyers in cycling won a bronze in the women's cycling time trial. And Connor White, also in cycling, won a bronze in the men's cycling time trial. I cannot think of any more way, or more fitting way, I'm sorry, to demonstrate our appreciation than by publicly recognizing these exceptional athletes who are making a difference and inspiring an entire country. Each of today's recipients have performed outstandingly well, and we extend our sincere appreciation to each and every one of you. I'm particularly pre pleased to offer these awards on the heel of July's presentation by the government of more than $80,000 to elite athletes in recognition of sporting excellence. You are the embodiment of, which can be, of what can be accomplished with determination, commitment, and dedication. On behalf of the Ministry of Youth, Culture, and Sport, congratulations, and we wish you continued success in the next chapter of your journey. Thank you. I now call forward the Acting Director, Ms. Nadine Henry, who will call upon the athletes to present their checks. Thank you. Good morning, everyone, and congratulations to the recipients once again. Uh, first up, we will invite the representative for Dage Minus. He will be receiving $2,500 for his bronze. Yes. Thank you. Next up, we have Caitlin Conyers, 2,500 bronze medal, women's cycling. And we have her representative. Of course, for himself, Connor White, 2,500, bronze medal, men's cycling. Congratulations. <laughs> All right, thank you. 
Next, Madeline Moore, uh, 4,000 for a silver medal. And we have a family representative with us today. Congratulations. <laughs> and last but not at all least, we have Emma Harvey and 6,500 6, uh, for two medals, silver in women's 50 meters and backstroke and bronze in 50 meters butterfly. Congratulations, Emma. Congratulations again. Um, yeah, I just wanted to speak on behalf of all the athletes in Bermuda just to thank the government uh, for this kind award um, and just for all the support um, through the highs and the lows. And it means a lot to us. And, you know, as everyone knows, sport isn't always easy, but the support, uh, it really helps carry, carry us forward through everything. And especially in this upcoming Olympic year, um, we really appreciate everything that everyone in this room has done for us. So thank you. Yeah, the, the, the funding from the government really does a lot for us as athletes. So, I mean, yeah, that's all I could say is just thank you, and we'll keep trying to achieve these results. Yeah, and we're all very proud to represent Bermuda, so thank you again. Thank you. Again, uh, we want to thank everyone for coming. And as you can see, as we often uh, do come to these press conferences, uh, as we say in the Department of Youth, sport and recreation, that sport indeed matters. Thank you.